First thing, congratulations first of all. Tell me, you're 3-0 up. It's a, a, they were, were top of the league. Second half, they're playing some silky stuff. Can you actually enjoy it at the back there? Not until after the game, I don't think so. Uh, we've got to try and lock down the pitch. and Unfortunately, we weren't able to do that. We uh, conceded a late goal, which um, we're disappointed with at the back. But, you know, we can't complain. Um, you know, 3-1 against a team like that, you know, we, you know, we're doing my little bit. I mean, it could have been four or five second half, couldn't it? You were almost unstoppable, weren't you? Yeah, you know, the forward lads, you know, going forward, uh, they were unbelievable at times. And um, <clears throat> like I said, defensively, uh, for the first half, they set in quite deep. Um, and we find, found it difficult to break them down a bit, but we always knew we were going to loosen them off. And, you know, um, hopefully, um, luckily, the, the crowd were patient with us. And, you know, we managed to break them down and we managed to get a goal. You've got quality players in your side, haven't you? Particularly going forward, we'll mention. I know Gary Rowick's just saying to Flickers there, he's been bemoaning individual errors, but I was saying to, to Flickers, you're making them make individual errors. You're making them go faster than they're capable of being. Yeah, I think, I think that's a bit unfair. I think, you know, um, he's got to give us a bit of credit. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? I think, I think, you know, a lot of teams would have, would have found it difficult against us today. Um, <laughs> Absolutely. So, um, no, I think, you know, there may have been you know, a few individual errors, mm. but we created enough to, to win by five or six. Like, e so. Exactly right, yeah. I mean, is that sort of the way they play in training? You, you, do you think to yourself sometimes, well, I know it's easy for me to say it now, but that's been coming. I know that's easy. Yeah, I mean, you know, we worked hard from, from day one of pre-season, mm. and, you know, the gaffer's you know, got a style of play, um, and he puts it in every player to, to, you know, pass the ball and, you know, play the right way, and, you know, everyone here, you know, has got that mindset, and, mm. you know, we've got the ability to go along with it, so... Um, no, that's what, just what we're trying to do. Yeah, I mean, you mentioned, I know you're disappointed because seen that, that, that the goal at the end there, but they give you a pretty good workout at the back, didn't they? Yeah, you know, they've got some good players. Mm. Um, Bevan up front. You Jeez, know, does, he ever, does he ever shut up? No, not really. <laughs> not you really. Man, imagine being married to it. Oh, no, yeah. Oh, yeah, my team's cold. He's an experienced experience pro. And, you know, they're a good team. You know, like I said um, before, I think any team that finishes above them will, will you know, potentially go up. Yeah, and we mentioned about some of those players offensively. Well, was Nathan Cameron going in that Lionel Messi down that right wing at a point, wasn't it? <laughs> yeah, no, um, I know. I saw the chance to break and to get us up the pitch, so you know, I took it really. Does he encourage you to do that? Um, he just encourages us to, you know, to express to ourselves, to, to yeah. do you know, what we feel is right. He gives us the right, you know, um, he gives us options, you know, and mm. it's up to us to, to pick um, you know, the right one for the team. Now you're there to be shot at, aren't you? Top of the table. Yeah, you know, that's just hanging on to it now. Yeah, yeah, I mean, you know, that's where we wanted to be. Mm -hmm. um, you'd much rather be up there rather than chasing. So, um, no, we're, we're happy to be to be shot at because, you know, we know, you know we're good enough and, you know, more, you know, got a lot of experience in the team, so we can mm -hmm. deal with it, really. I haven't talked about pressure, but Flick has just made an interesting point to us. He was saying that last year, where there's a threat of relegation, it's far more pressure than this. This is an enjoyable pressure. Yeah, I mean, especially the way we play, mm -hmm. um, we, we can express ourselves a lot more. So, um, you know, when we're not getting, you know, the threat of relegation, you know, mm. where we have to score goals. I think we've got time, you know, when we get to break teams down like yeah. we did today and be patient, do you mm. know what I mean? So, you know, we were able to get the goals today and um, we're happy with it. Saying to Nat, shall I go? No, no. I was going to say to Nat, I just took me right there then. But, I mean, exit to next week. Now, what do you make of them? Not doing great, but they're just going to be as hard as Burton, aren't they? Definitely. I mean, you can't take no team in, no. This, in this league lightly. Um, I think it will be a different game. I think they play, you know, similar to us to try and pass the ball yeah, out from the back. Um, so I think it will be a good one to watch. Um, hopefully we can we can do enough to shut up at the back, you know, for the front players to go and go and get yeah. the goals again. You just said you got a match on Monday as well, now, didn't you? <laughs> against Man United. Yeah. Um, are, you in the, are you involved in that? Is it? Um, I'm not too sure. I'm not oh, sure. I'll pull a stick here. <laughs> I'm not sure <laughs> what the gaffers um, play. Oh, no, we played them a couple of weeks ago. I know, he did, yeah. And, yeah. Um, you know, it's a revenge then this time. How did he get on? Um, unfortunately, we lost 4-2. Uh, uh, yeah. But, you know, there were some really you know, good players playing. Rafael, um, Herrera. You know, so it was a good test for all of us. Yeah. And, you know, getting these games, you know, in midweek, you know, can only, you know, improve us as a team, really. And can you go on and you're going you're to watch the Football League show now? You're going to look at the, the papers tomorrow morning, see you at the top there and have a little smile to yourself? Definitely. <laughs> Um, first X Factor, got to watch yeah. that first. But, um, yeah, oh, got, <laughs> sorry. <laughs> definitely match today, and then football league show. Uh, be nice to see the goals again, and you know um, to wake up, you know, tomorrow morning seeing us top is is good. Do you have an old city man then? Maybe not on the other side. <laughs> <laughs> no, nah, that's not for me. No, strictly. That's, 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 that's strictly, is it? Oh, no, it's strictly. <laughs> yeah, what was that long me. major run then, middle of the park? Then, where's that come from? I don't know. I just, like I said, I was just, you know, I saw the chance <laughs> to break, and I just took it really. Mm.
Has anybody around the dressing room mentioned promotion yet? Is it a bit soon for that? What do you think? I think um, it's been mentioned from the start. Mm. Really? You know, we've yeah. got um, a good enough team to, to, to go, and we've got, um, we've got the players and the experience um, to lock down games and to win games consistently. And that's what we've, that's what we've done so far. You know, obviously only losing one. You know, we just need to keep that up, and you know, for the next you know thirty plus games, we've got to keep going. Yeah. You look very happy playing through at the back, here, lads. I mean, not every team can pull that off. Yeah, we're comfortable. I mean, you know, playing alongside Pabs and and also makes it a lot easier. You know, two experienced players and two very good players. You know, makes you know my job easier, and you know, um, it gives you know the forward lads, you know, everyone in front of us to, to go forward, so we can you know defend. It's actually an attacking system. If if you use it right, isn't it? Yeah, definitely. Yeah. I mean, we don't we don't play defensively no. at home or away. You know, we've got to get goals, and yeah. you know, we never never you know really put it back to to five unless we're you know really really struggling. But um, you know, we're we're set up to go forward, and that's what we're going to do: score goals. That's right. Just what well, well, the was going to say about Nards then. No, putting the pressure in Nathan. Saying to Nards, would you take promotion now if I said third place, or do you really want the top spot? He wants. To, he'll take anything at any price. Um, Obviously, everyone wants to be champions. Everyone wants to win the league, but you know, if, if you said third now, I'd snap your hand off. Yeah. I think. Uh, I know you don't want what you had at uh, Northampton. Do you? No, no, definitely not. <laughs> you know, play a final defeat. You know, that's that's the worst you know experience I've had in mm. football. Was that? Yeah. Um, and you know, I wouldn't want us to go through that again. Um, but like I said, if, if third came up now, you know, I'd definitely take it. Really? Does something like that happening to you sort of drive you on to make sure that that doesn't happen again? Definitely. Yeah. I mean, you know, losing losing at Wembley. You know, especially in the way we did. You know, three 0 down after twenty minutes. Yeah. You know, playing the rest of the game, you know, it's tough mentally, yeah. um, and obviously knowing that's that's your last game of the season. It's heartbreaking, and, isn't it? You know, and to see them lift the cup is it's the worst thing in football, really. But um, like I said, if, if we can get things right this season, and you know, hopefully use that for me personally to to keep the team on and to push myself on um, to get into those automatic promotion places, then you know that's the best thing. So you don't want to go back to Wembley? <laughs> Not for that. Chances <laughs> for that. I think I'll, I'll take that. Yeah. Yeah, Cheers, Nathan. Thank you.